Let's have a look at the highlights of race one of the Toyota 86 Racing Series. Race seven of the championship. Adam Gowans from Tasmania on pole position. But on the first lap, he got it all wrong on cold tyres off the road at the top of the hill. Stephen Johnson and the rest of the field managed to avoid car number 11. But unfortunately, he was done for the race in an instant. Didn't even make it through the first lap. It was really willing in the mid-pack. Aaron Seaton moving through, getting a move on Trent Grubel, who came under fire too from David Cedars. The dicing here was unbelievable. Ben Grice went for a two-for-one deal. Got through Grubel, tried to get by David Cedars. Didn't quite get the job done. It was really willing in this first race of the weekend. Nick Filippetto ended up off the road with Duncan Harrison down at turn one, and then Filippetto went challenging John Iofola side by side across the top of the S's to Dandenong Road corner. Brave stuff, great racing. Stephen Johnson through to the debris, Aaron Seaton around the outside. That was for position four. Will Brown out front was moving away, but Aaron Seaton overcooked it. Stephen Johnson got back down the inside. Stephen, one of three invited drivers this weekend. Problems at turn one, Drew Ridge and Jake Klein getting it together. Jake keeping it nailed, drove it through the slush and the mud and the grass. Little spin here for Zach Lascalpo down at turn four. Series leader Cam Hill was in all sorts of drama, qualified badly and then got in a tangle with Josh Hunter. Ben Grice's last lap didn't end well. He had contact with Damon Strongman, but in the end it was Will Brown who took up the victory in Sandown winning race seven of the Toyota 86 Racing Series.